I just felt that they kind of disliked me. When it was singing time, I think, well, my mother was the idea that the louder you sing, the better you are. And I had an extraordinarily loud voice. And as soon as I would start singing in the singing lesson, at Stansfield, I don't want you to sing, be quiet. When my father would get a sixpence a week rise, which they used to get in the old days, my father never knew where we were living. We'd moved into another street. My mother moved every time my father got another shilling a week or whatever it was. We were moving on a barrow, and they asked me where I live in Rochdale. I say in every street. Actually, I would be like my father. My father was supposed to be one of the finest mechanics, but he wanted peace in his life. I want peace in my life. Always looking for peace, and I like happiness. Everything all happy around me. Well, of course, we can't, we can't have Mother sing without Father, and Father hasn't had time to learn his, a new song since last Christmas, so he has to sing the same one. He says, My word. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sorry. I'm giving you a key, love. Give me a key. I thought that would go short. My wife's gone. Me without any warning, my wife's gone. She went away this morning. When I found it out, my heart was filled with pain. For my wife's gone, back to her husband again. <laughs> Gracie, can you now, as we sit in the studio, form a picture in your own mind of your childhood? Can you see a scene of your home or your mother or your father? Now, try. Yes. Tell us what is what you see. Well, I, I can see one house we lived in, sort of the sink in the corner. I was always then, we're in school, we were always sort of, uh, I remember a scripture lesson about being tidy. We were very untidy. My mother was very untidy. My father had the feeling of being tidy, but I don't think we had any nails on the cupboards or anything. But he put his coat, I always remember, can see him putting his coat carefully on a chair. My mother would go up to the door, I see her coming in with her shawl on, and go to the door, put the, as if she's going to hang up the shawl, and it drops on the floor. And I said, Mama, you know very well there wasn't a nail there. You've just done that and dropped it on the floor. She says, I know, but there should be one there. Come on, Mother. Drink with me. 